This is Zach preparing, getting himself ready for his question of the day. Prepping. Prepping. And we are filming. And here is Zach doing his ritual. Not sure what he's doing. You might want to go this side, then then um, the sun's better. Yep. Is that better? Yep. This is the magic, of, the magic of making movies. It's all about the lights, the camera, the and the action, <laughs> and the talent. He's missing the talent. <laughs> but no, it's about teamwork, really. It is all about teamwork. There's no way I could be doing this on my own. There's no way John could be doing this on his own. No. Nope. Holding each other accountable, and kind of holding the space that we can do this every day. This is our third day of doing it. It's crazy. It's kind of like. It's going to be hard not to do it soon. Yeah. And the 10 days will probably turn into maybe once a week. And then if I could do it once a week for the rest of my life, that would be insane. Maybe we should make like a TV show. Oh! So my question I got... So this is day two of our question video challenge. Our video question... Take two. Creep. So this is day two of our question video challenge. Uh, the question is, how do I stay motivated to stay on track with my health and my fitness? So this is a really, really important question. Um, and I think it's really important to differentiate between motivation and inspiration. And short, if you want short-term results, yes, get motivation. And motivation you can get through um, setting goals. You can get through um, watching motivational videos on Facebook. You can get motivation through just starting working out and, and actually seeing results. Now, if you want long-term results, I believe in inspiration. And inspiration comes from inside. And mm. the best way to cultivate inspiration is to find out what you truly value. What is like the most important thing in your life? Is it family? Is it contribution? Is it, is it food? Is it knitting? Is it um, success or money? Whatever's really, really important to you, find out how fitness and health will help you achieve mm. your highest value. Ooh, so, boom. Boom. <laughs> hey! Don't film kids. <laughs> <laughs> so, Yes, inspiration. Uh, yes, m yes, motivation is important. But what you're looking for is inspiration, and uh, inspiration is an inside job. So find out your highest values. Find out your highest values, and then link your highest value to that activity, um, or, or that by achieving that particular activity, going to the gym, eating right, spending time with quality people, um, you know, getting good quality sleep. Uh, you know, all those types of things, link them and find out, write out 50 to 100 reasons on how eating well or going to the gym or um, sleeping right will help you achieve your highest value. And your highest value is just what's important to you, family, money, friends, whatever. Um, that is my take on motivation and inspiration. But there's also another component of it because I also believe that who we spend time with is who we become. So. You know, they say that we become the average of the five people we spend the most time with. So hang out, spend time with other people, friends or family or YouTube or whatever, like hang out with other people who will help inspire you to believe in yourself more. Because if you don't believe that you can actually achieve something, if you don't believe that you're deserving or worthy of something, you're not going to take any action towards it. So um, sometimes by spending time with other people who are on your same wa wavelength and you go, shit, they're doing a really good job. John's kicking ass, he's doing videos, he's like sharing from his heart. Maybe I can do that as well. Or when you see someone eating well out at a restaurant and they're on a diet and they, they refuse to eat the cake at night and you go, shit, that person's like, that person's uh, dedicated and committed. And when you see these people doing these things, um, for me personally, it helps me believe in myself. And the more that I believe in myself, the more uh, action I take towards those things that, that I just want more of in my life, if that makes more sense. So it comes from within, external and internal. Uh, anyway, that's a little bit of my view on inspiration and motivation. Awesome question, keep the questions coming. Uh, we'll chat to you tomorrow. Peace.